morning guys, welcome like to Saturday, Saturday. It's, it's, it's a nice kitchen. So Saturday and it. Gabby's gorgeous kitchen on Roblox. I didn't, I Goodbye, didn't Star it. Stable, welcome Roblox. No, we still play SSO. They still play SSO, because SSO is where it's at. I've been lounging around all morning. I'm gonna show you who we were talking to. I joined this live today, Liv EQ is the name of the girl, one of the girls, Liv EQ, that's her. Say hi, Liv EQ, she doesn't know she's being videoed dancing on her vlog. And then this is the other girl. So this girl is Gabby's age that's just dancing around. I feel like such a stalker, that feels so bad. And, yeah, and this is the, this girl's, this girl's Gabby's age, or Sophie's age, and they're so cute. Like, I love them. What's the other girl's name? Pink. I think they're Pay Peyton EQ, right? Or Pay EQ? Anyway, they were super adorable. I just joined their live at random. Sometimes when we join people's lives, kids' lives, they freak out. They just start screaming, and they did, and it was hilarious and so cute and so funny. And I love doing that, surprising people sometimes, just because it's fun. And my girls love it, too. They like to talk to them, so... I'm going shopping and Sophie's still hanging out in their live. It's been like an hour. Wait, let me ban this person first. You ban people? Yeah. I do too. Wow. Okay, so I'm going to give you guys a house tour. Here's my house. This is her house, her rich house. Okay, go fast because I don't have a lot of footage for this. This is the subscriber's room. I still have to decorate it. They play with a subscriber and she's been banished to the guest house, to the pergola. This is gonna be like a living room, but I haven't decorated yet because I'm broke. Because I tried to decorate. To be <laughs> broke, you guys. And this is my room. That's Gabby's room. I still Huge. have to decorate it. She's like me. She's not this even into decorating. Ooh, it's I decorated nice. the bathroom, but I still need more. Is that stuff. a big TV? This is a big mirror. Oh. But the mirrors in here are weird. Oh. Like the mirrors in this game. And then here's the guest room. That's where mama would stay. It's guest room. Here's dining room. Dining room, yeah. And then the kitchen that Kaylee decorated for me. It is gorgeous. Did Kaylee have to use her own money? No, it's mine. And this is Kaylee. <laughs> Down the hall, this is Kaylee's room. It's going super speed now. Uh, it's gonna be their bathroom. And then this is Sophia's room. Ooh, I like Sophia's room. And then, oh, are you ready to see my Lambo? Okay. Oh, are you ready to see my Lambo? Okay, her Lambo. Wait, I have to open the garage door because it's kind of dark in here. I have a black and white Lambo. It's beautiful. That's Gabby's dream car. There's a winter wonderland out here. Will you take me to go get shavings? Yes. All right, let's go. Look at how cool it looks, you guys. It's freezing out here. I've actually never been warmer in winter in my entire life. It's because I look like this now, you guys. This is the new me. Instead of nice coats, fancy boots, I got big, huge boots on, snow pants, leggings, two pairs of socks. I got wool socks. For the first time in my life, I own wool socks. I hate driving, especially in winter. So yeah, when Sam's home, I trick him into coming with me, and then he brings me and just all the work. <laughs> just all the heavy work. You know the expression, a watch pot never boils? Literally, Sam has been waiting all day for the hay guy to call him so that Sam can go pick up hay. And the minute we left to go get shavings, he called. So Sam's gonna take me home. I'm gonna clean the stalls. The girls are just relaxing. And even though it might seem like we're doing all the work, we're not. They work so hard every single day. I want them to still be a kid and play and hang out and do normal kid stuff. So that's why sometimes we do more of the work and they actually get to play. But literally, they work harder than a lot of kids I know. Did you already do chores? Yeah. I said I would come down and do them. Sam is, Sam's like so busy. Oh. Well, never before in life, before we moved to a farm, Sam, like we used to, we used to like watch TV, you guys. We used to like hang out and just have fun, but now we just work and it's fun work now. The 
um, mares are all out in the field with their noses stuck in the in the snow. I'm like, stop eating the stop eating the grass. It drives me crazy. I worry about them so much. I have a bunch of bags from the barn that we were where our horses are, and I I fill them up every single day. The problem is that I have special bags for breakfast and special bags for supper, and I can't take them all to the barn at the same time because I mix them up so I have to just do one or the other so today I'll be taking all of their food for the next week or so um for breakfast yesterday I took all their food for supper it's such a confusing system I think it makes it easier for the other barn all they have to do is pick up a small bag for Finn a large bag for Storm throw it in their buckets and feed hey Hendrix how are you big guy did you ever digest that bunny? Yeah, every time he eats a bunny, we know. Or every time he eats something crazy, he gets this big, huge belly bunny. Bunny belly. <laughs> yes, hello. So Fiona is going to take him to her barn. She just doesn't have anything set up for him yet. So she'll probably take him in the spring because he's comfortable here right now. This is He knows this place. Hello. Are you missing Storm? He's probably missing you. Here are all of my grain bags and a cat that I'm going to take to the barn today. Isn't it a lot? Like it takes me seriously a long time to get this ready. So these are morning buckets, morning bags. So I have to put in their morning supplements. And I'm sad to say that the girls are the ones that always feed the horses. So I forget what they take. Just joking. I can figure it out. This is what I give to Storm for and Willow for ulcers. And unfortunately, it's frozen. So yeah, I don't know how I'm going to do that because they absolutely have to have it. Willow was having big problems with ulcers. And what am I going to do? And the only way that I got her to, like, it actually will cure ulcers, let alone just um, prevent them. So I have to have it have to have it and I don't want to microwave it because that changes the composition of the supplement I have to take it up to the house with all this grain and try and thaw it out whenever the farrier or the chiropractor or the vet comes to our barn I always try and clean it up and make it nicer so when they get here they're like oh these people have clean barn even if it's not clean every single day <laughs> Hi, Stella Bell. The farrier is coming to check on your feet. Storm, you're home. Storm, why'd you put your hay over there, silly? Hi, handsome. You're home. He's like, I do not know what is happening in this world. I melted this in a sink full of hot water. Genius that I am. So now I'm going to finish up these bags while I wait for the, the farrier. But it's true, Storm's home. Sam and Gabby went to go and get him because he's having special stuff done to his feet. All ready to take to the barn. See how annoying this is, this process? Okay. All right, so Storm's here getting whatever he needs done for his feet. We're just trying something because there's a few different things to try to redistribute, redistribute his weight evenly so he's not bearing the brunt of his weight on the front of his feet. And Grace is over here eating popcorn. She's watching the movie of Storm getting his feet done. Did she like it? Yeah. So, sad news. The girls are not going back in the field. They're all getting chubbier. So that means they're eating something. He's 
guys, it's so cold here, like so cold. The hardest part is waiting for your horse to cool out because, because it's so cold. But Finn is turning into a superstar. Basically, he is really getting there, you guys. He's really getting there. The only issue that we really have with him right now is that he needs to burn off energy before he rides. And a lot of you guys have been saying, lunge him, lunge him, lunge him. But I mean, Gabby can stick it. Gabby can ride. Like he just needs to burn off energy before ride. He's only eight years old. How old is Finn? Eight. Finn's eight, right? Okay. Yeah, I think he does like jumping. I couldn't tell before. Like I might. Oh, I went. Hi, handsome. This is what I thought I did. Onto the dirt, like fly, like. No, that's what it felt like for you. It was like this. He stopped, and it was like one, two, three. Okay, I'll fall. Like you waited. It was slow motion. Oh no, it was very fast. No, it was so slow motion. Oh, handsome. Okay, he's done. So go put his blanket on and give him his grain. Because well, he's cooled I was out. Eat that. I'm still eat it. <laughs> Who cares? Horse germs. Good boy. I'm so yeah. glad. Do you love riding him? I ride bareback in winter. It's so hard. Do you like riding him? He's fast, forward, and fun. Right? I just don't like him when he bolts. I know. Did he do a lot of bolting this time? No, not that much. So the bolting is just because he has energy and he wants to run. Oh, I know. He's sweaty. Oh, sweaty makes you itchy, huh? Mm -hmm. All right. So this girl cried and cried and cried, and she's been afraid to canter the jumps. And then what happened today? Jump the jumps, not. Jump. You cantered the jumps. Yeah, but I wasn't scared to canter them. So now you're ready for your group lesson tomorrow because now you know how to canter the jumps. Yep. Fiona gave... No, you can ride Storm. You gotta get used to it. She has to get used to it. Fiona gave her some good tips. She can hold this part of his mane and do loose reins so that he doesn't jerk her forward. She loses the mane when he's landed. Like over the middle of the jump, she loses her rain and goes like that on her. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Come on, keep cooling him out. Go cool him out.